homies, welcome back to my channel. Today's video I've got, what was this? I'm just like, welcome back to my channel. Okay. <laughs> Today's video is my July favorites. And I haven't done a favorites video in a while, uh, but I've collected some stuff that I've been loving in July that I want to share with you guys. So let's get into it. I'm going to try and make it through this video really quickly because I had to shut off my air conditioning and my fan so that you wouldn't hear all this kind of background noise. And now I'm officially the sweatiest mess of all time. Always a favorite. Familiar with my favorites videos, then you know I always have a sneaker favorite. And this month I've been loving these. These are the Crayola Nike. Whoa. These are the Crayola Nike Dunks, and you can see they're called Crayola because they've got all this crayon looking marks all over them, and I just adore these. These are high top dunks, and yeah, I mean, how cute are these, right? Love these. I kept in the yellow laces because I just feel like it ties everything together with the check and then the bottoms, but it did come with white ones as well, so you know, I don't know if you could find these. But, I'm sure on eBay, but um, they do come with white laces as well. But how cute are the yellow? I don't know. I love it. <laughs> and to go with my sneakers, I've been loving these. These are all natural. These are made by Bamboo. And these are shoe deodorizers. They're all natural, bamboo charcoal, unscented. They eliminate odors in your sneakers instead of masking them. And it lasts up to one year. I like these because they're unscented. It just takes away the odor instead of masking it, you know, like spraying with, with Febreze or something like that. You're just going to max the odor, not uh, get rid of it. It traps the odors in moisture that you might get in your sneakers. If you're running around outside and, you know, I don't like my socks showing often, so I'll wear low socks or I'll have to fold my socks or just won't wear socks at all. And then, you know, it's hot out, we're going to get all sweaty. And so I've been loving these. You recharge under the sunshine every 30 to 60 days. Like, how cool are these? I'm going to be giving away two packs to the winner who wins everything. There's going to be a bunch of stuff involved in this video, but this is the first of things that I'm going to be giving away. And if you want to learn how to enter to win this whole giveaway, then just check out the description box below. My next favorite is my perfume favorite. This is a staple for me in the summertime. I don't know if I've talked about it in a summertime favorite video before but I have to throw it in right now because this is Dolce & Gabbana light blue this is just my absolute favorite scent for the summer every time I smell it in the winter time I just immediately am brought back to summer and the sad bottle is pretty much empty so I'm gonna have to run out and get a new one ASAP all right now I want to talk about my hair favorites my hair got beat up the past couple months I dyed it a bunch of times which I hadn't dyed it in years and then I just went full into bleaching and then trying to dye it back a little bit darker. And I've just been messing with it so much. Plus, I haven't cut it in a long time because I have anxiety over cutting my hair. But if you guys can see, it's, yeah, it's pretty long right now. And you can probably tell it needs to be cut, but <laughs> like I said, I... Mm. I hate cutting my hair. <laughs> I've just been trying to help it out with this organic coconut oil. I bought this at Target. You guys can find it pretty much anywhere. I know you've heard about it a ton now on YouTube and this really is a lifesaver though. I put it, I probably talked about it in a favorite video too, but I put it on my eyebrows to help them out. I put it into my eyelashes, just kind of all around my eye and I like to soak my hair in it overnight. I will mostly get down here but if you're trying to get your hair to grow then it's really good for your roots as well but my hair is like I said it needs some help down here so I'll just kind of soak all of this and then I'll put it up in a braid and uh, I'll wash it out in the morning with I'll show you this is another part of the giveaway mine are in my shower but I just did this actual this whole routine I just did this last night I came home from work and my hair was looking meh. So I soaked it in the coconut oil, threw it up, and then today when I woke up, well, after crawling to Starbucks, <laughs> I came home and I hopped in the shower and I rinsed out the coconut oil with this. This is Fala Cleanse Hair Solutions. This is the shampoo for normal to oily hair and scalp. That's why I like using it after using the 
uh, a coconut oil treatment. So I rinse out all the oil and then threw this shampoo in. You know that saying like squeaky clean? This is legit. You'll get your hair squeaky clean. I'm in the shower rinsing it out and like, you know, just going like this and just making sure it's all getting out and my hair is squeaking. Like <laughs> it will get your hair absolutely clean. And it says on it, deep cleaning formula washes away dirt, oil, and product buildup. Promotes healthy hair and scalp and leaves hair soft and manageable. And they're not lying. So I'm going to give away the shampoo as well as the conditioner because I do use these two together. And this is just the same thing, same brand, and this is also normal to oily hair. And it's a clarifying, moisturizing conditioner for shine, smoothness, and strength. Just been loving these two after using... I've been doing a ton of hair masks and the coconut oil and just tons of trying to repair all the damage that I've done. And after doing those types of treatments, my hair, it, my scalp at least, it does get oily really quickly. And especially in this heat, I'm just a sweaty mess right now. And this totally helps me out after doing those types of treatments. So I'm going to be giving away this set of shampoo and conditioner. So do you guys go to Whole Foods and just get lost in the health and beauty section because every time I go to Whole Foods with the intention to just run in and grab like some bananas or something, I always end up in the health and beauty section looking at all their uh, face lotions and all their skincare and soaps and makeup and this is one of those things that I tried because I'm just obsessed with trying all the stuff at Whole Foods and the skincare. And this is Derma E Overnight Peel with Alpha Hydroxy Acids. And I got it because it was on sale and they had a coupon. They had a bunch of um, printed out coupons right next to the products. And so I think I ended up paying only like $8 for it. And it's a pretty good sized bottle. Um, I got it, I probably got it towards the end of June. And the first few times I used it, it says to use once or twice a week. Yeah. So... The first time I used it, I put a pretty thin amount, you know, like just normal amount you'd think. And um, I woke up the next day and I wasn't blown away by any means. And tried it a couple more times that way and was never, you know, blown away by it. So I'm reading the package again after doing this a couple times. And I realized it says use a generous layer over face and neck. Leave on overnight and rinse in the morning. So once I read that, I'm like, wait, generous amount. Put on a, a good amount this time now. Like, it it's thick on my face. And then that's when now I'm realizing that, read the directions, Megan. Because now once I use this, now I'm waking up and now I see the difference. It's not a super strong peel, like your face peeling off peel. It's just a nice gentle exfoliating peel where you wake up the next morning you can see a little bit more of a glow. My hair is starting to seriously frizz out from this humidity. I gotta wrap up this video soon. Alright so my next favorite is everybody else's on YouTube's favorite and this is the Kat Von D Shade and Light Palette which you've probably seen before because I know everybody talks about it but believe the hype. This really is this shade right here on the end, subconscious. This is everything to me right now. It's my nose contour. It's what I use up in here. And then this one, the middle shadow play, I put this around my forehead. The consistency of the, the powders and the colors are obviously amazing. Uh, but then just like the consistency of them. Yeah, believe the hype on this one. Most hot. Why did I wear my hair down? Before I've been putting on my foundation, I've been going in first with this L'Oreal Age Perfect Cell Renewal Golden Serum. I just got this small little sample size. They had a bunch of these at my store and they were uh, not as expensive. And there was a deal going on where if you spent $30, you got $10 back on L'Oreal um, skincare products. So I got a couple of the smaller ones. I also got this little Age Perfect Cell Renewal Night Cream which I've been working into my nighttime skincare, but I don't know exactly how I feel about that one yet, so I'm not including it in this, but just to show you, I got a bunch of the littler sized uh, L'Oreal skincare, and I do really like this. Like I said, I put it on um, before putting on any of my makeup, I put this on. I like how it's got the golden little flecks in it. I feel like it, 
you know, it gives you more of a glow. My only, it's not really a gripe because I love it at the same time, but it does have a really strong perfumey smell, which I love the smell. I think it smells amazing. But at the same time, I'm like, this doesn't, just doesn't seem right to put on straight up perfume on your face, basically. You know what I mean? I don't know. I like it. And I must be into some sort of real strong golden thing going on right now because after I put on that with the, all the little golden flecks, I then put on, this is by NYX, this is called Honey Do Me Up. And it's got honey, which is a natural antiseptic. It's got gold flakes, which increases skin radiance. And then it has collagen for smoother skin. And I am in love with this. I'm so happy I got it. It wasn't something I would normally... I went into Target before going to the uh, Lana Del Rey concert, which I, anyway, I ran into, <laughs> I never made it to the show, but I ran into Target before the show and I wanted to just get some, something new to wear makeup wise that night just to kind of, you know, I was in a good mood, I was going to see Lana Del Rey and uh, I saw this and it was $17 I want to say, which is pretty pricey for NYX, for a drugstore, for, you know what I mean, like a primer at a drugstore, $17. But it just sounded so amazing. Honey, gold flakes, and collagen? What? Yeah, I got it anyway, and I'm so happy I did because I absolutely love it. I use it, again, in combination with the, at first I put on the L'Oreal, I let that dry for a second. Then I put on this, and then I go in with my foundation, and I've just been loving it, and I will definitely repurchase. For foundation, I've been loving this Cover FX BB Gel. This is a mattifying anti-blemish treatment. It does have salicylic acid in it. So it's a favorite right now for summer. I don't know if I'll be using it in the wintertime as well, because it is a drying formula. It, you know, more oily than normal, and this has been amazing for combating that, but... Um, so definitely a summer favorite foundation. I don't know. It's called a BB gel, but honestly, this is like full coverage foundation. And my dog is harassing my life right now. So if you have oily skin, I would definitely check this out. I don't know how it does with helping out acne, but for combating oiliness, it's amazing. I've been loving this Julep highlighter. It's a really pretty champagne color. And this is in the champagne color. <laughs> yeah, it's called champagne. This is Glow Highlighting Powder by Julep. And I just love the packaging. I mean, it's dirty right now. Sorry about it. But it's just, you know, plain black. And then it comes with a ton of product. I've had this for well over a month now. And I have not made a dent in it. It's well worth the price and it's just a really pretty highlight. I have it on right now and it's the only highlighter I've been using this entire month. My hair. <laughs> the longer we go on in this video, the more frizzy my hair becomes and all right, you can't see the packaging anymore because it rubbed off, but this is the Wet n Wild Mega Eyes maybe it said. I don't know. It's a little tiny What is this called? Black liquid eyeliner <laughs> in a pen form. You get just a really nice thin, thin, thin line. <laughs> what am I doing right now? Just coloring all over myself. So it's not super pigmented, but it's it was <laughs> when I first used it. And it so my problem with it is that it dries out pretty quickly, but it's like a dollar and so if you have to buy a new one every few weeks it's not the biggest deal and I just feel like you get just such a nice thin thin line as I've just showed you 25 times so my last makeup favorite is by Milani this is the lipstick I'm wearing right now and this is the matte this is the matte blissful shade I'm, even in the summertime, I'm still about that matte life, but, you know, if you want to bring a little bit more color, normally in the winter I'm going for dark mauve, dark nude shades, and I just really like this blissful color because it's still a nice pink pop, but it's still matte. So, the last favorite and the last part of my giveaway 
These are by Sebamed. This is the liquid face and body wash for sensitive skin, and that's what I've been using it for. I wash my face with it. Yeah, this is what I use in the shower to wash my face and wash my body. And I like it because it balances the pH in your skin, which I feel like is one of my skin's biggest problems. And then this is the hand and nail balm for sensitive skin as well. And I use this on my feet and on my hands before I go to bed. If you guys notice in the summertime how your feet just seem to be more dry, it's because you're wearing flip-flops more and you're out on the beach in the salt water and so I put this on before I go to sleep and then I throw on some socks and I wake up the next day and my feet are sorted out. This does say hand and nail balm and I do use it on my hands and rub it into my nails but it's also really good for your feet. So whoever wins the giveaway will be getting, there's the front side of this, oh, it's upside down. Whoever wins the giveaway will be getting these two products, the shampoo and conditioner and the shoe deodorizers. And again, learn how to enter right below in the description. And I have to go get some shoes out of my dog's mouth. So uh, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you next time. Bye, guys.